You know that great feeling you get when you find money you didn't know you had? Under the couches, at the very, very bottom of your overly full purse, or in the pockets of an old pair of jeans. Would you look at that? Well, something sort of like that happened recently. Only in this story, there isn't enough cash to go around, and a whole lot of people are going to be left in exactly the same spot they were before the dollars were even discovered. Thanks to a report published by the Government Accountability Office, or GAO, we now know that the federal government has $180 million unspent in the Restaurant Revitalization Fund. How do you just have $180 million sitting in a fund when thousands of restaurants who qualified for help all across the country didn't get any? We don't know. But we do know the Small Business Administration has agreed to distribute those dollars to restaurants. Of course, that happened only after the GAO found the dollars and published the report. A friendly suggestion from us at the CRA? Even though these grant dollars will be meaningful for the restaurants who receive them, no restaurant should get its hopes up. We've seen the disappointment that comes with that way too many times. While $180 million is a lot of money, it's not the billions in replenishment that the fund could have used. CRA members remember how hard we fought, along with our partners at the National Restaurant Association, for a badly needed replenishment of the fund. In the end, the U.S. Senate voted down that idea. So we at the CRA long ago started securing other avenues of relief like expanded outdoor dining and alcohol service and tax fairness in California for restaurants who received help from the Paycheck Protection Program. It's not yet clear how the SBA will award the remaining dollars or exactly when they will do so. The National Restaurant Association is closely monitoring what happens next. Moving on now. If you are a restaurateur who has not yet made plans to attend our annual food show in Los Angeles, you should consider it. The Western Food Service and Hospitality Expo is back at the LA Convention Center later this month after a two-year hiatus because of the pandemic. The CRA is the show's main sponsor, and we couldn't be more excited to welcome everyone back. In addition to all the products and services on display, there will be a long list of educational seminars put on by experts. The wide-ranging topics include presentations from our legal partners on all the laws and compliance issues restaurants need to be aware of. Oh, and CRA members can secure a limited number of free tickets. You'll be guided through this as you register. There's a link in the description below. And to those of you already signed up, we can't wait to see you at the Expo on August 28th. I'm Sabrina, that's the news you need to know.